If you have chosen or plan to choose a Hackney vehicle that features a drop pinch frame modification, you can rest assured that every precaution has been taken to verify full OEM chassis compliance. You see, at Hackney, we don't want you to assume the job has been performed correctly. We verify that it actually has been performed correctly. Once the chassis modification has been completed, every chassis is subjected to a series of strenuous compliance tests that are documented and on file in Hackney's engineering department. Hackney takes extra care to ensure that the resultant driveline modification is well within established tolerances. The inspection technician records a reading for engineering analysis and verification. Hackney uses a proprietary computer analysis program to determine the proper tolerance angle relative to the transmission and chassis length. Once the driveline angle is verified to be within tolerance, the entire vehicle is subjected to a simulated road test. This is accomplished by loading the rear axle to its rated load capacity using a hydraulic press. The press is swung over the rear axle and locked into place. Mud flaps are lowered over the tires to prevent damage from gravel that may be lodged in the tread. The hydraulic system is activated and the pressure preset to the rated load of the selected rear axle, in this case 24,000 pounds. The system is engaged and the hydraulic press applies 24,000 pounds of load to the rear axle, simulating a fully loaded body. Note the deflection of the springs. The technician moves back into the cab, starts up the engine, engages the transmission, and takes the vehicle up to road speed, typically 65 miles per hour. The transmission shifts through all gears to attain road speed where it is held to a period of five minutes duration. This test verifies two important tolerances. First, is the driveline properly balanced and does it exhibit any vibration? And second, is the rear axle alignment proper and not tracking? If any of these factors are negative, the test is immediately suspended and the chassis is moved back into the chassis modification department for corrective action. Once the simulated highway test is concluded, a final test is performed to verify correct alignment of the rear axle. This test is done using a laser alignment tool that shoots a laser beam from the rear axle to the front axle. Resulting readings are recorded for verification. Now your Hackney chassis is ready for the body to be mounted and completed as one of America's premier emergency vehicles. Just another reason why Hackney is America's rescue leader.